This is Gomer, and he's not your average redneck. It's Friday, got the day off from work. No better day to fire up Gomer's hot tub. However, hot tub is under here. And this is not your average hot tub. It ain't like your little city-fied fiberglass tub that you gotta, uh, you know, be real gentle with. So, uh, I'm betting that'll do the trick. Oh, look at that. What? Yep, that's an old bathtub. And Gomer's even got some nifty outdoor plumbing. I like to compare it to uh, a crock pot for snow. It, it, it takes a little while, but ain't no rush. And the uh, water hose is froze, so you do what you gotta do. We're gonna fill up and melt it down, and that's how we're going to uh, fill up the redneck hot tub. Come to think of it, this ain't as dumb as it looks. Yeah, one of the nice features of Gomer's uh, winter redneck hot tub is that it has a uh, built-in cooler. And if you like bubbles, well, there you go. Time for Gomer to put this puppy into action. Ah, normally I do this naked, but for the sake of the uh, general public. Yes, on behalf of the general public, we thank you. Oh, that's nice. Oh, 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 nice. Don't have to worry about overflow. That's not a big deal, but you want to try to save the bubble. Oh, I'm telling you. It doesn't get any better than this. Oh, redneck hot tub. And that, folks, is what we like to call backwoods brilliance. There you have the most perfect winter experience. What could be better? Oh, come on. I bet you can think of one way to make it better. Come on in. Uh. You're my boy, Gomer. <laughs> Cheers, folks.